been asked to answer the question, what happens when you go off the map? So I thought I was going to tell you something that was on the map because it was like everything is on the map. But actually there's a park in New Hampshire that is not on Google Maps. Now there were maps that I was able to find it on because I needed to verify the name or thought I needed to verify the name. But anyway, I went running one day as I was off to do uh, in New Hampshire and, and still am off to do. And But then I would go exploring a bit more. It's hard to explore in the city, you know, roads that you haven't been on when you've been here for a while. And uh, I found this amazing park when I just went exploring. And actually, I, you know, found multiple different running paths. So exploring is a good thing. Um, but we were cautious. I mean, exploring can be a bad thing, too. So I went running with a running partner the first time I went to this park. And we sort of went along the park as far as we could, and it was getting dark. And I don't remember what season it was. I think it was in the fall. And, uh, you know, New Hampshire running in the dark and winter. I mean, basically we could have died if we had gotten lost, uh, or thought we could have. I mean, the park is decent size, but not huge, so um, probably would have been able to find uh, our way to safety, even if it had gotten dark. But we turned around, and um, I don't think we ever went back running, the two of us, but I went to that park time and time again the rest of my time in New Hampshire. So uh, good things can happen when you explore.